Hey Sparks, 52 week financial challenge time. Man, are you excited yet? Because I really am. You all overwhelm me with the comments and the private messages. And all I can say is such a blessing to be a part of your life just as much as you think you're a part of my life. You think I'm blessing you, but you're really blessing me and my husband. I don't comment back because I want other people to actually go on and read all the comments and all the momentum and things you all say. So thanks for joining the challenge. As you see from the slides beforehand, it gives you the goal and the mission and the vision. This is week four of the financial challenge. So this week, thank you. I'm going to say thank you to Win dixie because guess what? At Win dixie they give you money for shopping there. If you spend $75, they give you five bucks off. Well, I spend that much with five of us to feed weekly and I cook dinner. <laughs> Look at our receipt. <laughs> so um, I only shop buy one, get one free. And consciously, it really helps you save money. So anyways, I got my dollars. You go to the customer service area and they give you actual money. So thank you. So I'm going to take my money. Here's my little heart-shaped box I'm putting it in. And we'll count it here can't really see it but it's one two three and week four but they gave me five but I'm just gonna do whatever this is one I'm not putting it in y'all can but um that's my view week four one two three four if you're just joining the challenge you should have ten dollars saved we are on week four week one one dollar week two two dollars week three three dollars and week four you have four dollars so it's all in here and my husband's actually outside cutting Manster's hair so I'm gonna put his money in his box here is one, two, three, and four. So that's going in his box. He has some extra money. I think I might have to do something with that. <laughs> Thank you to everyone on the challenge. I'm gonna keep this one short and sweet. You all know that I'm working the flea markets on the weekend, so I work full time during the week. Me and the kids go work the flea market Saturday and Sunday. I switch them out on Sundays, but I'm working there, so I'm the one I don't know. You know, 16 hour days on weekends. I still need to run a Win Dixie with another coupon to get some money and cook dinner for my family like I do every day. So I want to encourage all of you. I know that you've asked me about my bankruptcy I had in 2005. Look for some videos about how you can get back on track for your own financials to purchase your own home or, you know, do what you want to do to be financially free. The other thing I wanted to mention here for you all saying that say I want to either own a home, start a business, or go to school, college, or get a certification, there is an awesome program called an individual development account. I'm going to put everything I can in the comments below. Sign up for that program through your local city. It's through the government. I've done it twice. You can, for every $1 you save, the government will give you $2. Years ago, they give you $3. So let me explain. You save up to $2,000, the government will match your $2,000 as $4,000, you'll have $6,000. And you're saying, no, Tina, you for real? Listen, the first year I did that, they gave me nine. It was my $1, I saved $3,000. They gave me six, no, they gave me $9,000, I think I had like $12,000. It was a lot of money. And they ended up paying off a student loan. Then this time I used it to purchase my house two years ago. There is an income cap, like $45,000. Um, but once you get in the program and you make more, which happens to me, you still qualify for the program. So again, Google search, put in individual development account, your city and your state. I'm telling you, there's a program around. You just got to find it. The reason why we don't know about things like this is because we just don't know. I'm giving you everything that I have, everything that I have. So again, if you're around there, that's great. If you say, well, I don't you know, qualify for that, but I'm still having some financial challenges, or I just want to learn how to be you know, a better saver with your budgeting, which I refer to as a conscious spending plan, you know, consider going to, I went to a class called Pathways at my church. You see, it's 2006. <laughs> um, I went to Crown Financial, which I actually teach Crown Financial, which is a biblical financial study. You can do Dave Ramsey's Financial Peace University. You know, don't be ashamed or embarrassed. There are so many people in situations with the economy like it is, or, you know, living above their means. And you know what? Guess what? Life happens. But if you want to get ahead, do something different. That's been on my mind so much. Instead of doing the same thing over and over, do something different. If you want to see change, do something different. Do something. One thing, something small. 
it will produce a great big result. So again, this is my encouragement to you. Week four, 52 week financial challenge. Get your money in. We will finish stronger than we start. Thanks everyone that's on the journey. All right.